Are you ready to confront the terrors that lie beyond our world? War of the Worlds by H.G. Wells isn't just a story. It's a chilling glimpse into humanity's confrontation with the unknown. But is this 19th century classic still relevant in our modern age? The War of the Worlds was first published in 1898, and it is a landmark work in the science fiction genre. The novel tells the gripping story of a Martian invasion of Earth, blending suspense and speculative fiction in a way that was groundbreaking at the time. H.G. Wells is known as the father of science fiction. He was an English writer known for his vivid imagination and ability to blend scientific ideas with compelling narratives. Before the War of the Worlds, Wells was already known for classics like The Time Machine and The Invisible Man. His books explore science, society, and the effects of new technology, making him prominent in modern science fiction. In The War of the Worlds, H.G. Wells takes us into the calm life of Victorian England then disrupts it with the arrival of strange Martian cylinders. What begins as a curious event soon escalates into a terrifying invasion, as the Martians emerge with advanced technology and devastating weaponry. The story follows an unnamed main character trying to survive in a world turned upside down by the invading Martians. As he witnesses the destruction and chaos, he meets different people, each dealing with the disaster in their own way like a desperate priest and a clever soldier. The novel keeps readers on edge as humanity fights for survival against an almost unstoppable alien threat. One of the book's greatest strengths is how Wells contrasts the ordinary with the extraordinary, turning familiar places into scenes of unimaginable terror. Wells also delves into the psychological impact of the invasion on his characters feeling dread and powerless, and also focuses on the fear, panic, and desperation that grip them. One weakness of the book is that some readers might find the pacing uneven, with some parts feeling slow when Wells describes the Martian technology or the destruction they cause. Also, the lack of character development can make it hard to connect with the protagonist or other characters. However, the novel's enduring power lies in its ability to provoke thought and unsettle readers. The War of the Worlds is a cornerstone of science fiction often compared to other seminal works like Mary Shelley's Frankenstein and Jules Verne's 20,000 Leagues Under the Sea, written in 1898. Wells' novel was groundbreaking in its portrayal of an alien invasion. If you have read and enjoyed The War of the Worlds, then you might appreciate these two recommendations. The first is The Day of the Triffids by John Wyndham. This classic novel presents a post-apocalyptic world where a mysterious comet shower blinds most of the population, paving the way for aggressive, carnivorous plants known as triffids to dominate the landscape. The second is Childhood's End by Arthur C. Clarke. Clarke's novel examines the arrival of a benevolent alien race that ushers in an era of peace and prosperity for humanity, but at a significant cost. You will have to read it to find out what that cost is. I will post links to purchase the books mentioned in this review from Amazon in the comments. Any purchases made through the links help support my channel so that I can write more reviews like this one. Please like, subscribe, and engage in our discussions.